Hey yo together and very welcome to the Stuck of 2 Crazy Replays today on Terraform Ladder Edition with the TVP Best of 3. Woo! Yes, you heard it right. Best of 3 time against this guy. So we have spawn in the right bottom position playing as Protoss. It's the... Uh, yeah, playing as the right Protoss. It's Colibri. There we go. And he's playing against me. Spawn in left top position the Blue Terran Alex Sasha. So, Colibri is off racing as, as Protoss. He normally plays Zerg, as you can see here. And he is a Master League uh, Zerg currently. So, that's, that's really nice. And he's all more already annoying with this probe. Oh, yeah. Very annoying, this guy. Very annoying. Uh, currently, I'm not impressed. Just chasing this probe. This is exactly what you should do. So here you can see how you should try to defend. There we go with the gateway. Pulling 6 SCVs already. Which indeed hurts my income. But he is not probing whatsoever. So it's all right he's producing a probe here and there. Okay. So he's not fully committing to this. But it's still fine. I'm ahead in worker. I can produce. I cancelled that one. I can throw down a barracks myself. And you need to do that, because you need to make sure that your barracks finishes before his gateway. Otherwise, he will just chrono out a salad, and your marine is too late and you can't micro because you don't have anything to micro and to lose. He's still probing a little bit, but he's committing quite a lot, so I guess that's fine. The probe already taken some damage, so you need to be very careful how he manages that. And yes, of course, it, it hurts, but you need the time to make sure the barracks gets down, and you can produce a bunker in time to defend. So I tried to kill that one, didn't quite grab it, which is really bad. Yeah. I still try to get it, but it's so difficult. There we go, Marine will be out, and this gateway will finish, but no, he cancels it. And now I'm in a good position. Uh, sure, everything is a bit delayed, he's taking gas. Okay, but we are equal in worker. This is good. And yeah, there's the bunker. So there we go. Now he's producing a salad. Might even chrono it. But there we go. Orgle command. It's fine. It's it's okay. Income wise, you see it. I'm ahead. Which is really interesting considering that uh oh no, he's taking gas, that's why. Okay. Yeah, no chrono out of this salad, and he might just cancel it because it won't do any damage, yeah. He, he rallies it back, which is okay. So now I could salvage the bunker. Uh, I did one big mistake, which is being supplanked. Oh no, okay, very good. Very good so far. So, Pylon, second guess. He's still on one base, me too. Uh, I could throw down a command center, he won't see it, nope. Uh, throw down a bunker, yeah, that's very important. Throw down a bunker. He could go for a Stargate, <laughs> which is exactly what he does. I hate cheesy Protoss, man. I hate it. But yeah, that's that's that. So, mm, I'm not gonna scout it yet. Which is not good. I might. Mm, uh, it's it's difficult. I mean, with, with constant SCV and uh, marine production. I should have enough to defend our oracle, an oracle, but if he goes in with two, then this could be very difficult. Because the factory won't be there in time, no way near. And there we go, Stargate finishes, where's the oracle, there we go, Chrono Boost, buddy! No? Ah, Chrono Boost is his nexus. Okay, so no Chrono Boost, that really helps me out a lot. Uh, warp Gate Research, not even begun, so... Wow! Okay, gateway and robotics and the nexus and behind that the one oracle, which is out now. Mm. Okay. Maybe the video mine will be in time. Maybe. Nope, I'm getting a tech lab. So this can deal a lot of damage. I'm just now scouting with the SCV, which is quite late. 
I wanna know if it's one base or two base, but the Oracle will hit. Okay, there is nothing, but he will be able to deal a lot of damage in my main base. Uh, this Oracle got a lot of energy. And four Marines are not enough. You go and he kills all the Marines. So that's really annoying. He got enough energy left. Uh, yeah, splitting those Marine uh, CVs as good as possible, but that is real damage. Oh, look at the focus fire. He's so annoying. Uh, he might lose the Oracle now. Oh, so close, but he killed a lot. Eight SCVs in total, that was a good Oracle. I mean, he had to deal damage, but now he's good far ahead, I would say. He, he dealt a lot of damage there. Crippled my economy completely. Uh, there we see the factory. Two, two factories and then a the starport, very interesting. Uh, there's a bit of mine, just in case of a second Oracle, I guess. Uh, I should put it down, yeah. Where does this Widowman go? Oh! I try to be sneaky and get it... <laughs> okay, let's see how that works. If it, if this Widowman makes it the whole way there and kills a bunch of probes, that would be awesome, but it's most likely not gonna happen. Who lets a Widowman walk into your natural land burrow? Oh, war prison behind that, so very annoying for me to deal with. But income wise it's looking good. Yeah, he sees it. He burrows. I will get one kill here. And that's it. So not too much achieved. Oh wow, the salad on top of the widow mine. Punching that one to death. Uh, behind it we see Colossus and extended thermal lands. He doesn't know about Mac. Oh he knows. Ah uh, he knows. So very interesting decision here to go for Colossus. It can work, but most likely it doesn't. It's Most of the times I face Auric, uh, Colossus as a mech player, I win, because Auric, uh, Colossus aren't that good. I really, I really need the gases, which is what I'm doing now, taking with those. Mm, swapping a little bit around here. Three Vita Mines not in the best position. There's this Warp Prison, and it might be very annoying with that one. Yeah, those Vita Mines. Uh, two of them being boosted now. There's the drop. I'm producing more and more Vitamines. Vitamines are good in defense. Oh, I didn't see it. I didn't see it at all. Plus one attack is coming. He might just... Yeah, there's a cannon, so he shouldn't lose too much to that. And uh, there's a Hellion. Just scouting sees no third base. That's good. Ah, uh, the probe might die. Ah, uh, he throws down the Nexus before, that's good. Still not using the Warp Prison here. There's a second Widowmine drop, so will I wait? Or will I go in? Because normally you have to time that. Uh, we will see. No, I'm not timing it perfectly. I'm just boosting in. Widowmine 1, Widowmine 2. How many kills will they get? Oh, 5 kills. And 3 kills, that's good. And here? Oh, eight more kills. That was that was very good. So now I'm ahead in worker, and you see, double vitamin drop does damage. And there's another one moving out, but here's the war person with the salad. Ah, uh, there's oh the vitamin. Ooh, good splash damage. But he might just warp in more units. Oh, the vitamins at the perfect perfect time here. Hitting. Ah, uh, ah, uh, he didn't kill too much there. Uh, but he's annoying. Uh, Marines are moving in here. But there's a second double Widowmine drop. Oh, the action is real. Kiting. Just a little bit. Not gonna work too well here. There's one Widowmine. There will be a second one. Still not cleared. Uh, Widowmine, Burrows, the second one as well. Get the shot off! Very nice. Oh! Very good shots. That one's still active. There's still a salad, but Hellions will clean this eventually. <sighs> we are both harassing each other to death. Literally. Uh, this armory took a lot of damage. The gas, not perfectly saturated. There we go. Uh, no add on that. I, I really need more gas. I need to take that base. Widowmine gets cleared. And it looks like he might just move out soon. 
Could be the case. He's getting plus two and blink. He got uh, four stalkers so far. He's getting some sentries. Yeah, he got a lot of gas. He might also throw down a Twilight Council. Uh, Temple Archive soon. Ooh, Helbert drop and Vitamine drop. As well as... Ooh, look at that. <laughs> That's how I'm trying to play mech nowadays. I try. If it's possible for me, I try to drop my opponent to death and expand behind that. Grab more factories. Whoopsie daisy, there we go. This time no Vitamines. Helbert time, baby! Woo! And there we go. More stuff. So he, he pulls his army there. He will be able to clear this, but... Ah, oh, the Medivac's dying. Uh, yeah, Photon Overcharge used again. Vitamine kills a bunch of stuff there. Might get a kill there. Oh, nice. So, yeah, the damage wasn't too good. Uh, but I kept his army back again. Forced in some defensive warp ends. Which is really good, but now he's attacking. He has enough. He had enough. He's attacking. And the army supply is not looking good for me. Look at that. Uh, 47 against 59. Mm, the problem is, I did deal damage, but my tanks are out way too late. So, this could be game ending here. Uh, there's no way to hold this one. The bunker is empty. There are Vitamines, but three Colossus. And all those sentries. I got just one tank. No, that's GG. I would say no way. Uh, he's going for that one. Ooh, if he gets me enough time. Oh, Helbert dropped there. And there's no cannon to defend. So defensive weapons again. But he might just go for it. Those Hellions are not Helbert. There's one tank here. Uh, more weapons defensively at home. Oh, he oh, gets the Medivac. He goes in, blinks on top of the tanks, takes them out. The Medivax can't heal anything because there is nothing. There we go. GG. Game number one goes to Colibri. Well played. So my transition was way too late. Uh, but you can see the drops can deal a lot of damage. What you need to do is take the third base way earlier, get the gases, and of course make your transition in time to defend that. With six tanks, four Vitamines, and 12 to 16 Hellbats with the Medivacs. No, uh, and, and some Vikings, four Vikings. I would have held this easily. And you can get out this army in time. I mean, 17 minutes, hello. So, yeah, Colibri won this game in this best of three. So, how will it go next game? You will find out soon. Stay tuned. I hope as always you enjoyed. And yes, see you next time. I wish you a very nice day and 